Welcome. By the end of this video, you will be able to hide the player name in the games that you're creating in Roblox Studio. Let's get started. So you're going to want to have Roblox Studio open. And this will work with any game that you're creating. I'm going to go ahead and click the racing template here. So typically when you play a game and you are in Roblox, you're going to be walking around and you'll see other players and their names will appear on top of their avatar. So what I will show you to do is how to remove that name from the other players. So uh, in order to do this, what you're going to want to do is go over to the Explorer tab and make sure you can see your Explorer tab. Go up to View and click on Explore and Properties. And so you have your Explorer tab open and you're going to go to Starter Player. Just click on Starter Player, the folder itself. You do not need to do the drop down. Once you have that selected, you'll see in the data on the, uh, the properties on the bottom right hand side, they have a name for starter player, but then they have a name display distance. And so right now it's set at 100. So that will show uh, the names of the people that you are seeing on Roblox. So if you would like to remove that, all you need to do is set that to zero and press enter. So now when I'm playing this game, if I see other people join, I will not be able to see their name on top of their avatar. Now that setting that I just showed you will do this for all players in the game, even if you used a plugin like a load character for maybe an NPC. And so if you've got an NPC in your game, then you can, uh, this will work for that. Or if you want to uh, just change it for that one NPC, but you want to see everybody else's name, what you can do is when you have your character loaded, so I'm going to go ahead and load a character real quick. So I'll just spawn this character. And so you want to find the character in the uh, workspace. And so once you find it, I have it selected and when you have it selected you go down to the properties and you'll see that it's got a name right here and so this is for your non-player character i'm just going to delete the name and then present it and so now for that npc it will be able to move around the game without any name above it and this will be, be helpful for if you want everyone else to see the names of those that are playing but not the npcs so you now know how to hide the names of the players who are currently playing the game, as well as any NPCs that you have inserted in the game. If you have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comment section below. I do my best to answer those. I have other Roblox Studio tutorials available. I'll put links to them around this video. If you enjoyed this, please like and subscribe. I thank you and I'll see you in the next video.